Animal Mechanical Mission Time! Animal Mechanicals! We Animal Mechanical can! Rex Mechana Strong! Unicorn Mechana Fly! Komodo Mechana Gizmo! Squatch, Makana Stretchy! Animal Mechanicals, Makana, can we do it? We Animal Mechanical can! We Animal Mechanical can! Makana Cuckoo Clock Island. Animal Mechanicals. Good morning, Island Owl. Very big mission today. Ah! Yes. Your destination is McKenna Cuckoo Clock Island. That sounds fun. It is fun. But unfortunately, the big cuckoo clock there has mysteriously stopped telling time. Poor cuckoo clock. Because the clock has stopped, everything on the island has stopped too. Not good. Your mission is to get the cuckoo clock to tick-tock again. Mechana, can you do it? We animal mechanical can! Let's go! Yes! Canna Cuckoo Clock Island! Hmm. It's just like the Island Owl said. Everything on the island has stopped moving. Over there! It's the Cuckoo Clock! I see it! There's the big hand and the little hand. Don't you just love clocks with all those numbers, Rex? Numbers? Uh, yeah, sure. Numbers are fun. Hey! Some of the numbers are missing. That has to be why the clock isn't working. I don't think so, Mouse. I am sure that missing numbers are not the reason the cuckoo has stopped working. No? No. You must be right, Komodo. You know so many things. That I do. For instance, I know that a mechanic cuckoo clock has a mechanic cuckoo bird inside its belly. Do you mean there's a bird in there? No way! Sasquatch, wait! Mechanic cuckoos have very sensitive stomachs! Woohoo! <laughs> Little cuckoo bird! Hello! Oh no, the mechanidors! Sasquatch, duck! Duck? I thought you said it was a bird, not a duck. <laughs> Bird. It's trying to open the doors. Oh, oh. Maybe he wants to tell us how to fix the clock. Oh. Oh. Nope. Those doors are stuck shut. Oh. 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 It's okay, Cuckoo Bird. We'll get the doors open for you. Looks like we need some kind of tool to pry the doors apart. A tool? That sounds like a job for... Komodo! <laughs> Makata Gizmo! <laughs> Nope. Uh-uh. My disguise! How did that get in there? Aha! One straight and sturdy McKenna screwdriver to the rescue! Handy dandy tool time! You know, next time, you might want a duck. Right. Uh-oh, the cuckoo bird is flying away. We'll never get the cuckoo clock to work if its cuckoo bird flies away. We have to catch it. 
But the bird's so high in the sky. How would we catch up to it? Flying high in the sky is my kind of job. Unicorn! McKenna, fly! Tree? Did you leave me here on purpose? Cuckoo! <gasps> I get it! You're trying to tell me that we need to pick the numbers from the tree and put them back on the clock, aren't you? Cuckoo! Come on! Let's go tell the others! <sighs> What's the matter, Rex? Okay, I'll admit it. I don't like this mission very much because... Uh... I'm not very good with numbers. That's okay. You're really good at other things. You're the best lifter and digger. I know, but I've had lots of practice doing that stuff. Hmm. Then maybe you just need a little practice with numbers. Look! Unicorn is back! I think the cuckoo bird wants us to replace the missing numbers on the clock. Cuckoo! That was my idea, too! Hmm. I'm sure that replacing numbers won't fix the problem. Well, I think it's worth a try. But how would we even figure out what numbers we need? I know. Clocks have 12 numbers. We just need to count from 1 to 12, and then we'll know what numbers are missing. And get some good practice, too. I'll start counting. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 is there. And after four comes... Um, five. Five comes after four. Cuckoo! Hey, wait, the five isn't there. No number five, but number six is all set. And seven. Come on, Rex. What's after seven? Um, eight, right? Eight! Then comes nine. <gasps> but look, the nine is missing too. Yup. But I see the 10. 11 is okay, and so is the... 12! Animal Mechanicals, this clock is missing numbers 5 and 9. Mechanic, can we replace them? We Animal Mechanical can! Come on, Cuckoo Bird. Let's grab those numbers and fix that clock. Cuckoo, cuckoo! 5... I am still doubtful these missing numbers will make any difference at all. But we have to try. Nobody's tall enough to reach way up there. Someone is, if they stretch. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, right. I can stretch that far. Sasquatch! Smakana <laughs> Stretchy! First the five. <laughs> and now for the nine. Okay, Cuckoo Clock. Start tick-tocking. Hmm, it's not working. I told you, those numbers are not the problem. <sighs> oh, well, I guess I was wrong. Hmm, something doesn't seem quite right to me. Six, seven, Eight, six, ten. <gasps> Wait! The numbers are the problem! Look! There are two number sixes on the clock. That number nine is upside down. Rex is right. See? Six, nine. Ma 
Mouse, I owe you a big apology. Missing numbers were exactly the problem. You were right all along. Thanks, Komodo, but I couldn't have solved the problem without Rex. Then you're both number experts! Yay! Animal Mechanicals, mission accomplished! McKenna, can we go to the number tree and practice counting more numbers? We Animal Mechanicals!